made all the way back home so casual unintentional way past mellow super real good morning everyone happy friday today is march 1st and we are kicking off my birthday month with a relaxation massage so yes I am on my way to get a massage at the Ritz Carlton and have a little spa day. So PK surprised me and booked me a spa day. I love that. I love just all the little surprises that he does for me. And I'm just so appreciative. So he booked me a massage for today and I'm doing a 90 minute relaxation massage is what he said. So I'm excited to be able to just relax for a few hours, have some alone time and just kind of zone out. And I totally plan on utilizing all the amenities. You guys probably remember last year, Christmas, he gifted me a massage for the Ritz Carlton. I had mentioned I was going on a spa day and somebody was like, well, is it a spa day if you are just going to get a massage? Yes. If you are going to a facility where you can not only get the service, but you can also utilize all the amenities, the pool, the sauna, the hot tub, the gym, whatever it is that they offer, that to me is a spa day. I don't know. That's a spa day for me. I do plan on going to the sauna. I am gonna bring my baby suit, but I don't think I'm gonna get in the pool, but I'm just gonna bring it just in case. Yeah, I'm just, I'm looking forward to it. So yes, this is a spa day because I will be there for several hours utilizing all of the things. I think for the very first time, I have never, ever, 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 and I've gotten many massages. I've never let them massage my scalp. Like, you know how they do like the head massage? As soon as I get in that room, that's the first thing I tell them. Um, no, you can, you can skip the head massage. But today, today is the day that I am going to let whoever is doing my massage I'm going to let them do, uh, I'm going to let them do a hair massage on me. Just because I've never had it before, my hair isn't done, and that's usually why I don't let them do it, is because usually my hair is done and I don't want all that oil in my hair. But I don't care today. I do not care. I'm just going to let them go in and go for it. So. Yeah, I'm not putting on any makeup. I'm gonna put on some moisturizer. I already washed my face with my Josie Marin pineapple uh, cleanser. I love this stuff so much, it's almost gone. So, well, let me wash my hands real quick. So yeah, and then I'm just gonna put on this uh, Argan Milk moisturizer. This is another bomb product that I am literally like all out of. God, this stuff is so good. I want some more of this so bad. I'm going to mix my argan oil with this. But I'm just wearing this little jumpsuit from Target. So cute. I'll link it for you guys. So comfortable. It's like wide leg at the bottom. I love it. I'm wearing a size small and I think it fits perfect. It's so comfortable. Don't have to wear a bra, which is great. This is like the perfect like spa day outfit. Like it's not too, too tight and just want it done. Not only did he book the spa day for me, he booked it on a day where Seth doesn't have school. Today is Friday, Seth is out of school. Their school is having like some archdiocese something. So there is no school today. So I got to sleep in and I don't have to worry about rushing to get out of there to go pick him up from school. So I can literally spend as much time there as I want. My appointment is at 11. It's just perfect. Like it's not too early. It's not too late. I was able to just have a slow morning, have my coffee. Yeah. Let's see the older woman. I'm going to do a little bit of perfume. I'm just gonna put on this missing person. I don't wanna put too much 
and this doesn't have lasting power so it'll probably be faded off by the time I get there. I'm not gonna wear any jewelry. I'm gonna keep my earrings in just so I don't look like a boy. And throw on my gym shoes, throw on my little Nike cardigan over this and my coat. I'm gonna take my Reeve Gauche tote, bring my book, bring my five minute journal so I can do that for the month. And yeah guys, happy March. Now let's hope the weather starts to warm up so we can really get all the spring feels and it'll be great. So let me go get my bag packed up and get my coat on and then we'll head to the Ritz Carlton. Alright y'all, so it is Sunday and I wanted to come back and do a little recap of my spa day. This was probably the best massage I've ever had. This woman was so good. It was a 90 minute massage and let me tell you, she touched me everywhere for 90 minutes. The scalp massage, oh my gosh, I don't know if I can never not get a massage without letting them do my scalp anymore because that oh it's so it was so so nice and relaxing i'm not one of those people that can fall asleep during massage i'm usually like thinking my shoes off and make a noise it was so relaxing and just so nice the whole experience was nice and 
I've had massages at the Ritz before. This is probably my third massage at the Ritz. Pecan, I did a couple's massage there before. And then I went last year. And I've gotten massages at the Langham. Um, I actually got a pregnancy massage at the Langham. We stayed there for our little baby moon. We did like a baby moon staycation there. They're nice. The Peninsula has a really nice spa. Um, Park Hyatt has a nice spa. PK got a massage at the St. Regis for his birthday and he said it was really nice. So yeah, highly recommend if you have a luxury hotel where you live, check out the spa and just have a nice spa day. I went to the sauna, that was nice. And we have a sauna here in the building and I never use it. I probably use it like three times since I moved here. And that just reminded me that I need to start using that sauna more because that was really nice. Like just, ugh, I loved it. I loved every minute of it. I wasn't in a hurry. I took my time. They gave me complimentary rosé. I got the whole relaxation lounge to myself. It was literally like I was the only person there. Like there was no one else around me and it was a little spooky. <laughs> But like the service people were there, like the housekeepers and stuff, they were there like doing cleaning and stuff. But as far as like guests, there was no one else at the spa. Pretty much had the place to myself. It was so, so nice. Did not end up getting in the pool just because I was like, there's no one here. And I felt, I got scared to be honest. I was like, what if I drown? Um, if it were like a nice day and it was like an outdoor pool space, I would have totally laid out by the pool. But I skipped the pool and just spent most of my time in the sauna and in the re relaxation room. And afterwards, I went to the restaurant and I didn't get any food because I wasn't hungry. Um, but they have the best. I don't know if all Ritz Carlton's have <laughs> this donut at their restaurants, but they have a pistachio lemon donut that is so delicious. And I don't know if y'all know this, but I'm obsessed with pistachios. I love pistachios. I eat pistachios every single day. And I could not leave without getting it. And so I got a donut and then the sweet girl at the register was like, you know what, I'm gonna give this to you as a treat. She's like, this is gonna be my treat to you. And I was like, oh my gosh, thank you so much. Cause when I walked up, I was like, I just finished my massage and I cannot leave out of here without getting this donut. And she was so nice. She was like, you know what, this is gonna be a treat for me. I was like, what? thank you so yeah of course it was delicious did that got my nails done as you guys saw it's not coming up on camera but i decided to just go with a bright pink the weather is gonna be nice you know i'm just feeling all the spring feel so i was like you know what we're going bright with the nails because we're manifesting spring weather here so i did like a hot pink it's opi y'all i did not get the name of it I'll text my nail tech and ask him if he can give me the name of it because I know you guys are going to ask. What's the name of the polish we did on my nails? Uh, number four. And I ended up doing this one and I like it. It's so pretty and so, so bright. Um, I'm just wearing this little like scam slip dress because it's Sunday. We ain't doing nothing. We're just relaxing right now. But I got the most amazing PR packaging from Josie Marin. And I wanted to share it with you guys because I was like, oh, oh, so good. This box is so big, y'all. It's it's huge. But let me just see if I can. This is the box. And it says Josie Marin on the front of it, here on the side. It's massive, like it's huge. It's so hard. Okay. Here it says the feel good naked movement starts now. I didn't go through all of it, but so cool. They are launching their pure argon oil body whipped argon oil body butters. Um, that are supposed to be like sustainable and oh, here. so you get refill pouches and then the containers and just talks a little bit about recycling bohemian fig vanilla vibes 
in topless tangerine. And they sent me the body butter and the body scrub. So, I'll show you guys. Lord have mercy. So, here's, <laughs> here's everything. And then this is what's inside. Oh my gosh. Okay. So, here's the container. It's empty. Oh, they also put a nice handwritten card in here as well. Yes. What's this? Okay, PJ has joined us. Um, so, yeah, I got a handwritten card and. Yeah, it just says. Uh, we left these we left these jars empty so you can fill them with our whipped to perfection exclusive formulas using our brand new refill pouches so here's the jar yeah I'm showing the people so here's the jar argon whipped oil body butter okay let's see so this is the Vanilla Vibes. Bye. Okay, bye bye. Okay, he left. Uh, this is the, what is this? Oh, Bohemian Fig. And it's Vitiver and Vanilla Orchid. This one is vanilla bean and juniper berry topless tangerine is pixie tangerine and pink grapefruit oh you just fill up your jar with the body butter and i have definitely tried one of <clears throat> so i did try this one that they sent me a while ago and i loved it i actually really love whipped body butters i think they're really nice so i'm so excited to try these so i got those and then you get another jar that says body scrub get the same the same ones in the scrub pouch so this is the bohemian fig tangerine orange and the vanilla vibes so yeah guys i'll let you guys know how i am i'm loving these i'm going to definitely try them out tonight when i take my shower i'm so excited and maybe i'll show you guys how i fill them up how it looks when you like fill up the jars i think that would be really satisfying so i'll share that with you guys but yeah i'm gonna go because i need to eat it is almost 11 o'clock and i haven't eaten anything so i'm gonna go and make me some breakfast and i'll check back in with you guys later i don't know what we're doing we'll probably go out go for a walk it's supposed to get up to like 70 today again so nice so we'll probably do a little walk yeah i'll come back and check in with you guys a little bit later all right Good morning everyone and happy Monday. Uh, PJ and I just got back in. I took him to the playground after my run this morning because it was pretty nice outside. So I figured we would go to the, to the playground and he had a blast. Now I am sitting here. I just refreshed my tulips. I got two bunches this time just so it'll be a little more full. They're so pretty. 
So I did that. Now I am waiting on I'm waiting on this company to come and pick up some donation items, some things that I'm donating. Donating our glider from when PJ was a baby because we do not need that anymore. So I'm kind of like doing like some purging right now. I'm not always the best at going to the Salvation Army and a Goodwill. So I found this company that will just come and pick the stuff up for me. So they're local. All I have to do is put in the date and the time and they literally come to my door and pick the stuff up. So I've got everything at the door waiting on them. They just called me and said they are 15 minutes away. So yeah, I'm just waiting on them to get here so that they can get this stuff off my hands. Then I'm gonna shower and get some fresh clothes on. That's all I'm doing. Just trying to be productive on this Monday and get stuff done. Yeah, so far so good. It's been a good day. I had a nice run. Took PJ to the park, so that was a nice little two mile walk in addition to my two mile run. I'm gonna make him some lunch and then he'll be ready for his nap, so. That's what I'm doing, but I'll come back and check in with you guys in a little bit. All right. All right, y'all. I am just getting ready to put some mascara on. I just did a little bit of blush and concealer. Put this mascara on. And then I'm going to head out because I want to run a few errands before I pick stuff up from school. Stuff that I know he's not gonna wanna do with me. So I'm like, let me go and do it. I did wanna let you guys know that I used the Josie Marin scrub and body butter, y'all. So in here I have Vanilla Vibes, OMG. This smells like a cupcake, but in the best way. It's so, it smells like a cupcake. So good. It doesn't smell like an artificial vanilla. Oh, it's so good. So I did use the scrub. It's so nice. It's nice and thick. Really, really nice and hydrated. The scrub has a really nice consistency. And usually with some scrubs, you know how you, you'll use a scrub and it just like slips out of your hands and you feel like you're just wasting the product. This is, does not do that, which I was worried about because to look at it, it looks like some of the scrubs that I have that do that. No, as soon as you put this in your hand, gosh, I wish I could demonstrate for you guys, but you put it in your hand and it does not move. You literally have to rub your hands together and just like rub it all over your body. And sometimes I have to turn my shower off to do my scrubs just so that it's not like rinsing away. I didn't have to do that with this. Obviously I stepped away from the water, but I was able to fully exfoliate my entire body and this stayed on my skin until I went to the water and rinsed it off. So that says a lot about a scrub because y'all know if you are someone that uses exfoliants and scrubs, in your shower put those scrubs on and they are literally falling off of your body before you can even rub them in oh she's good she's thick like you can look at the consistency and tell like this is not moving this is so good i cannot say enough good things about it I, that's what i have on I scrub and the body butter so yummy texture of it literally it, it's like you're putting icing on and what I like about it is you know how some body butters and lotions when you try to like rub them in it's like it takes forever to like for it to absorb into your skin this instantly turns into an oil like but it's not like greasy it just feels so good and it smells amazing so I did not want to leave without porting back because I am a fan. I can't wait to try the other fragrances out too, but I love, love this vanilla vibes. It's good. It's so, so good. I use both of them use every day since I got them, which I got them two days ago. I've used the scrub twice, but this I've used day and every night after my shower and I absolutely love it. It's so good. So if you're looking for a new body butter and scrub and I love this concept of 
the refill pouches. Once this is gone, I can fill this up one more time and I might still even have a little bit left. I'm definitely going to cut open that pouch and get all of that product out because yeah, this stuff is really, really good. So I'm loving the vanilla vibes. I'll let you guys know the other ones when I use, start using those, but yeah, I am a huge fan. <sighs> now that I have gotten clean, oh, what fragrance I wanna wear? Like what? I'm trying to think what would pair with this. I'm gonna do. What am I gonna do? I'm gonna do my Atrape Breeze by Louis Vuitton. Because I haven't worn this in a while. It smells so good. That's my fragrance. And yeah, so I'm going to. Get ready to get out of here and I will check back in with you guys later. Bye. Say hi to the vlog. <laughs> a few. So, so.